Angran is a city in eastern Uzbekistan. The city is located on the Angran River 70 miles to the east of Tashkent. The city of Angran was created in 1946 from the villages of Jigarastan, Jatepur, Teshiktosh, and Kwiksona which had emerged in the rich Angran coal basin during World War II. There were several large coal mines and factories in Angran during Soviet times. Following the collapse of the USSR, the majority of these factories were abandoned. A lack of professionals and machinery, mismanagement, and falling income levels, all contributed to this downfall. While Angran was once an important industrial center, nowadays it gives the impression of an abandoned city and is often referred to as a ghost town. Still, Angran has retained some of its industrial importance. The city is home to a once considerable and still functioning coal mining industry. It also has a large construction materials industry, a rubber processing plant, and a power station. The current name of the city is a recification of the Persian word Ohangaran which means blacksmiths. In 1936, first geological explorations were carried out in the Angran Valley. In 1940, the first coal mine was built in the area and it became operational in 1942. In 1941, Angran and Tashkent were connected with a railway line. During World War II, several settlements, namely, the villages of Jigarastan, Jatepa, Teshiktosh, and Kwiksona grew up in the area. On June 13, 1946, the Supreme Soviet of the Uzbek SSR issued a decree to create the city of Angran from these settlements. In his book The Gulag Archipelago, Alexander Solzhenitsyn mentioned Angran as one of the Soviet towns that grew up next to a gulag labor camp. Later it turned out that most of the city had been built above coal seams therefore. In 1956 Angran was moved to a different area 7 to 8 kilometers to the southwest of its original location. Angran was an important industrial city in the Soviet Union. After the dissolution of the USSR, the majority of ethnic Russians and Tatars living in Angran left the city. There were many experienced workers among those who left. In the 1990s, almost all of the factories in the city were closed down as a result of a lack of professionals. Disruption of Soviet trade routes, aging machinery, and mismanagement. Nowadays Angran is often referred to as a ghost town. Angran is located in the eastern part of Tashkent region. On the Angran River 70 miles to the east of Tashkent. On the northwest of Angran is the Chatkal Range. On the south and southwest of the city is the Kurama Range. The mountains that surround Angran rise up to 2,500 to 3,500 meters above sea level. The weather is relatively cool and pleasantly windy. Angran has a hot, dry summer continental climate. Prior to the collapse of the Soviet Union, Angran had a significant Russian population. The population of the city declined in the 1990s because of poor living conditions, unemployment, and mass emigration. In 2005, Angran had a population of 130,000. Uzbeks, Tykes and Russians are the largest ethnic groups. Angran has retained some of its industrial importance. The city is home to a once considerable and still functioning coal mining industry. Angreen's coal reserves represent almost one quarter of Central Asia's coal supplies. Two-thirds of Angreen's coal is extracted using the surface mining method. 
The city also has a large construction materials industry, a rubber processing plant, and a power station. The Angrand Pedagogical Institute was the largest higher education institute in Angrand. The city is also home to technical and medical universities, several academic lyceums, three music schools, and one sports school.